Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's Avery, and I'm back with some with episode two of Jedi: The Fallen Order. This game has been pretty sick so far. The first episode was pretty action packed. We're gonna get right into the second episode right now. I'm not sure if it's gonna. I would assume it kind of gets a little bit slower, um, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Let's get right into it. You gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. Calico! You were talking in your sleep, but weirdo. <laughs> Says the one who's staring at me in my sleep. All right. Is this like a uh, lightsaber creation station? That's gonna be sick. I don't want to customize now, but it looks like I can't. This is so sick. Got the kitchen. <laughs> Let's play some tunes. and witness events connected to it. You feel its history. It's an echo in the force from the object. Not many Jedi have that skill. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi, but not anymore. Do I know you? No, but I knew your master, Jaro DePaul. He was a true guardian of the Republic was a hero. Listen. Something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but my connection to the Force is damaged. When I meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. And it's like I'm back in that moment when... You survived, Cal. And you're not alone. Not anymore. We'll come up with our destination. Jedi I knew discovered it before the purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire <laughs> doesn't know this place exists. No. So, what's the plan? We hide out here? We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. Since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But, until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the Force be with you. Someone I should meet. I don't really understand if she really wants to build the Jedi Council so bad. Why is she pushing away? If she was once a Jedi. Why is she pushing it away? I guess I'm looking for a Jedi then. Look but at that guy. One here, why does Seer need me? 
This game is really nice looking. I wonder if there's a way I can just turn on and off my lightsaber. Holy crap, look at this planet. What's this? This looks like a safe place to meditate. Just need to focus my mind. Is this how you save, maybe? <clears throat> save point, yep. Skill tree. So you can spend a kill, uh, skill point. Overhead slash. Luck of power strike. Powerful strike that is deadly against weaker enemies. <clears throat> Might as well start it off. Let's learn it. So press a Y to do it. Okay. Cool. Then enemies have respawned. Oh, hey, what's up, little hey, guy? I'm Cal. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi. I think. Hold on. You know the Jedi? I like you this know. guy. Wait, hold on. Did you just okay. that? Thanks. Alright, we got a pal now. I like that. That's the Vault Seer mentioned. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. He's gonna got he's got a map for us too. Reach the vault. <clears throat> BD ones. Sweet. So how do I get out of this? All right. I sense something over here. That's a really big bug. Jeez. Let's try our new uh. Oh my gosh, the way you just slice these things in half. Oh, that's so sick. Holy crap. If I get up on this, huh? What? Oh. I feel like you should be able. Whoa! Sense an echo. After boggling eggs in the pack pot back. Huh. So I can learn things that happen just by interacting with objects. No way they were here. Guess that's why BD1 warned me. Alright, maybe I'll listen to you next time. We going back then? game just feels so smooth as it begins to lag a little bit. Any ideas? Gotta get across this gap somehow. Zipline? Zipline? Just jump and use it. Whoa! Cool. cool. How'd you know that would work? Wait, <clears throat> you didn't? I'm gonna have a set point. Let's rest up a little bit, might as well. 
don't have any skill points yet, so. So I'm guessing right when you enter that, that's when it saves. Getting here. I think it's Doors sealed. locked. Careful over there. Following you. It doesn't look safe. <laughs> Just like back at the scrapyard. Hmm. I try. Ooh, there we go. Cool. Whoa! Hold on, I'm coming. Let's take this. Let's take this thing out. Wait, this. Oh, holy crap, dude. This game is so sick. Oh, shit. Oh. oh my gosh, the combat system is so cool in this. Just look at the interaction. This is sick. It's over here. Whoever lived here used this room for storage. They kept food and supplies. Really? Probably could have figured that out just by looking at it. I guess we can slow this down, huh? Quickly. How'd you get through here? That was pretty brave. You okay? Oh, he's Wait. injured. I can help you with that. Will you let me? Oh. <laughs> okay. This guy's cute. I like him. Well, your scomp link is busted, but this should help you get moving for now. Okay, try that. Sweet. So I can repair him too. A hologram. The vault. Yeah, that's where I was headed too. Okay, well, first we gotta figure out a way out of this place. Says. Hmm. Oh, okay. It's got the color of the emitter, switch, sleeve, material. Hey, this is sick. So we're going to get a decent amount of customization in this thing. Oh. Oh, you already know I'm putting it this to gold. Let's get a better sleeve. Oh, this looks sick. Oh! Kind of like this. Oh, I kind of like the one we already have, to be honest. It's kind of cool. Oh, they're all kind of cool, though. Ugh. I'm gonna keep it the same. So we got blue, green, and orange. Okay. Well, I've always liked green, so I think I'm gonna go with green. This is sick, dude. Oh! oh. Nice. I don't know where you got the crystal for the green, but <laughs> I'll uh, take it. That's a little small for me. Don't worry. I'll find my own way out. Ooh. Tight fit, right. but this should work. Oh, this is so sick. I wonder if we'll be able to dual wield at some point. That'd be awesome. Wow, dude, this game is just so nice. Someone lived here. I feel like we should be able to interact interact with these blinking things. I guess not. I guess we'll just go up. I'm already in love with this game. Holy crap. You could just like slice through these poles, just you just slice through the environment. Maybe not this, but. Oh! 
Okay. Probably should've seen that coming. Yeah, I'm alright. Okay, so he can heal me now. He can heal me, cool. Healing stem. So I can fix him up and he can heal me. surprises. Thanks, little droid. Okay, let's try this again. So yeah, this is kind of a tutorial right there to... Uh, okay. <laughs> Here, hop on board. Wait, this droid is so sick. So, how'd you get here? I don't remember. I've never known a forgetful droid. Can't argue with that. Use that to swing around. What's over here, though? Hey, a chest. Think the Jedi would mind if we grab supplies? What are you doing in there? So what was in there? Ooh, a new emitter. Sick. So that's how I'm gonna find uh, different parts for the. Uh... So oh, that's like a little checkpoint thing. So if I fall down, I can get back up. <laughs> that's where we need to go. I can feel it. Let's see how interactive this game is. Oh, the lightsabers look so cool. I mean, they look cool in every Star Wars game, but jeez. Look at this area. Mapped everywhere we've been. Sweet. So how do I get into the so oh it's those elevations too. I can't make it over there. We gotta find another way. New objectives right there. I'm guessing we can take this to go over that way. I can make this, right? Oh, nope. I'm a Jedi. Come on. He can make that. Oh, I thought I could take... I guess it's a zip line, not a... <laughs> oh, man. That's just... That's so satisfying. Where are you going? More lightsaber parts? Fine. Poncho material. Huh. You can change the poncho in the pause menu. Customization. <laughs> Alright. So I can wear whatever I want whenever. Damn! Alright. I didn't know this game was going to be this, like, this interactive with the customization. That's awesome. I kind of like this suit right now, though. This tool was used by someone eager to reach the vault. This guy didn't work out too well. Rest of store life and force. Rest is not required to save your progress. Okay, see, so we, yeah, so we just have to enter here to get the save. <clears throat> oh man, dude. This game is so cool. I love how I ride the droid. To... Oh, here we go. Oh! Scan. What's this? A bog rat. What is that? Oh! Run for it! What do you mean by run for it? Let's fight this thing. Oh. 
Oh my gosh. You missed him. Oh. Woo. Yeah, sit down. Scan this thing. So I've only got one more stim, huh? Got another skill point though. And Ogdo. Oh. Not looking too great in health. Get a rest here. Let's also check out these skill points. See what else we can get. So we get our stims back when we rest, which is nice. Seems like we can only get two stims so far. <clears throat> Cal's maximum force is increased. Cal's maximum life is increased. Cal dash dashes forward and attacks his target. Jump while dashing to flip over it and target instead. So, I'm gonna go with this for now. I, I'm really liking the combat. We can go for that for the health and stuff after. But it seems like there's three different trees so far. So if we hold, whew, if we hold why that happens. <clears throat> oh. One. What are we what are we supposed to be doing in here? I know we probably could have head straight towards that uh what is that noise? Moving out. What is that noise? Holy crap. What is that? I who I don't know about fighting that yet. See something in there? Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but with persistence and the Force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Now, do what you must to reach me. Huh. Again. Clumsy. Try again. Trust yourself. Yes, Master. Focus. We'll all run now. Oh, this is gonna be so sick. Now, reach my position. Oh, no way. <laughs> hey, that's so sick. This wall running. So it looks like I can only wall run the raggedy stuff. Oh man. Think you can show me that shortcut again? Yeah, I'll see the shortcut. So looks like we're gonna go right through here, take a left, go underneath a couple areas. What is that red area? 
Oh, that's the locked door over there. Oh, this would be awesome. Oh. Oh. Wait, this is so sick. This area was used for meditation. There's someone familiar with the Jedi Order. It looks like we might have to go... Job. A para fish. The movement is so cool. It's so Assassin's Creed. I feel like there's a way I, I should be able to. I'm probably going to get a double jump at some point. This. Whoever owned this bag brought it from Coruscant. They were frustrated with the Jedi mm. Council. Ooh. Is there a way I can force pull that? <clears throat> I wonder. the map <laughs> all right so I'm already back on the so I can take a zip line up or I could jump down to the elevator and I can take out my lightsaber automatically which is awesome or I don't have to attack first So there was something back there that we could probably get at some point, but it didn't look like you could get anything. I thought, okay, there's that fish dog. Decided to discover a giant creature that lives close by. A spinog, they called it. Spinog. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Holy crap. Tell me how to fight this Spinog without full health. Can you slice this? <laughs> Sorry about your scalp. But standing up to that bog rat, pretty brave. Yeah, I'm gonna stay away from that thing. Good timing. BD1? Just making sure he's still there. Spalocks. All right, let's get to this temple. I don't want to fight that big thing. Looks like he's resting anyway. He's not causing any trouble. Racy there. Oh, it's on. This little guy's fast. We're not finished yet. 
Okay, okay. He's gonna be in here. Won. Probably. Vault. What's down here? Amazing. Are these are these supposed to be the fates? The fates up on the uh on the wall? I think so. You all right, BD? Well Jesus. done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Eno Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Oh. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. You know, I've been alone for while now without any purpose just hiding there's no way to live not for a jedi or a droid maybe seer was right maybe we're done hiding hey you want to meet some uh Friends of mine. Now we're gonna restart the Jedi Council. That's what we're gonna do. Zepho. I found what you wanted me to see. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. Right, let's get back to the ship. Oh, hey, big guy. Oh.
Oh, it looks like this is another one of those creatures that died. Are you going to be able to unlock this? If so, you are a handy droid. My friend, it appears the Cepho had some interest in death of you. <clears throat> Strange. For such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. Let's go, BD1. Let's just restore our health a little bit. <clears throat> Should be a lot quicker than the way in. Should I go down there? Maybe. Probably can find some stuff if I go down there. <clears throat> oh, hi there. I think it looks like it smells worse than Grease does. Oh! You die, you lose all your XP gains since your last skill point. Damage the enemy who kills you will restore your XP loss and refill your life and force to their maximum. Huh. There's something down there. There is something down there, though. Oh, wait, this thing's like a mega boss. Get off of me! Holy crap. What is this thing? Is it regain his health back. Holy crap! I can't get hit at all. BD one. I'm just gonna get to the ship. All right. Well. This could be lit. Oh. Man, there are gonna be some sick interactions in this game. Especially if they add more, like, environmental um, movement. Moving out. You passed the test. So you knew about BD-1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. 
What is that? Get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Don't get out of there! Get out! That is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of petroleum fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of Force-sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A holo what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. Hello there. That's actually sick that they put Obi Wan in there. We could rebuild the Jedi Order. Oh, that's so awesome! Empire. I love Obi Wan. Okay, no problem. Let's get it. Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zepho homeworld. All right. Well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look. Before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? Yeah. I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. Dathomir Zepho, it's your choice. So I get to choose where we're going next. All right, well, I think I'm going to take a save here. I think I'm going to call it there on the episode. That is episode two. That's actually so sick that we got to see Obi-Wan. Um, I named episode one Hello There, but I probably should go name this episode. It. But other than that, I hope you guys did enjoy that. If you did, hit the like button. I'll be posting episode three pretty soon. But other than that, I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace. I can feel it. Somewhere inside haunting Like a drug I keep on wanting There's a love that fits so perfect It's hard to believe There's a reason I can feel my heart stop beating